let them spend all the money they want. You know, we we got the people, we love the people, we work with the people, and organized people beat organized money every time. So it is what it is. New York Congressman Jamal Bowman told me in a recent interview that he's not concerned with APAC's multi-million dollar initiative to unseat him and other members of the so-called congressional squad. Well, historically, uh, throughout our history in this country and globally, uh, whenever people of color, whenever black men, whenever black women uh, speak up and push back against a system that's unjust, uh, the system is going to push back. So this is APAC pushing back. And this is, you know, them as a, you know, actor, mostly for a foreign country, uh, trying to control our democracy completely, which is unbelievable and the entire country should be pushing back on that. Last month, APAC, a pro-Israel lobbying group, launched a $100 million campaign to have representatives Bowman, Ilhan Omar, Ayanna Presley, Summer Lee, AOC, and Rashida Tlaib removed from office due to their views on the Israel-Hamas conflict. Since the Middle Eastern conflict began, squad members have continuously called for a ceasefire in the region and for Palestinians to have access to humanitarian aid. They also called on the Biden-Harris administration to reprimand Israel for war crimes that have resulted in the deaths of thousands of women and children in Gaza. Bowman is confident that he and the other squad members will not be replaced. Let them spend all the money they want. You know, we, we got the people. We love the people. We work with the people. And organized people beat organized money every time. So... It is what it is. Bowman says in the meantime, he will continue to, quote, focus on doing the work for the people. I'm still going to continue to speak truth to power and continue to focus on uh, doing the work for the people in my district. We're going to continue to focus on fully funding public schools, you know, dealing with the issue of economic inequality, uh, uplifting the issue of reparations and fighting for that, uh, fighting for universal health care. Uh, fighting for green, clean, renewable energy in our spaces, uh, pushing back against a criminal injustice system that targets black and brown people. Bowman emphasized that despite APAC's efforts to unseat members of Congress, the organization will not stop the work he and his colleagues are doing for their districts. In Washington, Ashley Banks, The Grio.